What's up, America? You're back in the studio with your host, Power, and this is the Power Hour. Today, I have a guest via satellite, and today's subject is going to be when hookups go wrong. So, we'll be touching on a couple of different things today, but my guests will remain nameless. So, guest, I have you on the phone. Say hello to everybody. Hey, everybody. So, before we uh, had the cameras rolling, you were telling me about uh, someone you hooked up with that has a deformity, a facial deformity. You said they have one eye or something. Please explain. Okay, stop right there. Stop right there. You said you have a cockeyed baby daddy. So are we to believe that you laid down and let somebody who's cockeyed go in between your vagina and you had sex with somebody who cockeyed? Hold on. First of all, the dick don't have an eye on it. So, um, I don't know if that's true. Okay, second of all, first of all, listen, listen. If the if his eyes are cockeyed, then his dick is cockeyed, honey. I guarantee you when he shot that nut, he shot it in the wrong place because he couldn't see it. Continue, go ahead. <laughs> okay. Anyway, he came up with this story like the time they him and like a couple of his friends trying to confirm the story or whatever. That he got shot. Someone to his car and got shot. That's how he ended up cockeyed. But I'm trying to figure out how you gonna be cockeyed and you don't have no exit wound, no, it, no bruising. Okay, well, first of all, first of all, he didn't get shot. Second of all, America is trying to figure out. My original question is how you fuck somebody that's cockeyed. We are still on that, <laughs> so that that would really need to be addressed. But So, so you, so does he wear a patch over the eye? Does he wear sunglasses, Oakley's, or anything? Or he just free cock eye? He just, um, he can only wear his sunglasses. Mm. But what I did find out is when he get a bust of nut, his eyes straighten out. Mm. Mm. This is interesting, very interesting. On on so many accounts, this is this is very interesting. I, I I thought that it was men who just got horny and desperate and would fuck a cockeyed female, but now I see that females <laughs> will get so desperate themselves and fuck a cockeyed man. I'm just I'm really appalled. No, so no. let me ask you this, guess. Okay, that's all good and fine. What America wants to know, and what my guest in the Power Hour, our, excuse me, the Power Hour audience wants to know. So, are you just handing out free pussy to all the handicaps? Are you just going around fucking people in wheelchairs and shit? The war veterans with one arm and shit? Are you just giving out pussy to all the deformity people? I mean, what's what's going on with you? It ain't like that. First of all, he came at a time when I was, like, going through something. He was like that shoulder to cry on when the other nigga fucked up. Okay. So, it ain't like... Well, we want to know, where do you hang out to find cockeyed people? I mean, are they just, I, I, it's, where do you find cockeyed people? Where do you find them? Yeah, like, where'd you meet this cockeyed? Did you meet him at the eye no, doctor? Yeah, 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 like, um, everybody is just in their own little zone. Everybody just mixing up together. Like, they just mixing together. Oh, okay, interesting. Well, we thank you for sharing that story with us today. Do you have anything else you'd like to share with us today, guest? Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Okay. Well, that's been a little segment for the Power Hour. Today's subjects, again, have been when hookups go wrong. So to all my guests and to all my Americans out there, if someone approach you with crooked eyes, walk the other way. Don't make the mistake that my guest today made. And that'll be it. You guys take it easy. Be safe. 
and keep your eyes straight. One.